Aerial Assault Ruckus used to be one of my favorite legendaries back in the day when it was it was broken and the dashes would literally send you flying to the skybox. You would dash once and you'd literally be like almost at the skybox, which was pretty insane. It's it's pretty nerfed now, but I'm still going to do a fun little video on it. Um, this map's going to be Bizarre. Bizarre is an interesting map for Ruckus because I don't really think Ruckus is that great on it. He's good if you can, you know, make your way all the way through the mid cap and get, get behind, but that's pretty hard considering how narrow the lanes are, how open it is too with long sight lines. So I decided to try Aerial Assault on that map. It seems pretty decent. You can go over the walls on the pushes. Someone was, I forgot who, but I read it in the comments. Someone was recommending Aerial Assault on this map. So we're going to go ahead and do it. This is the build we're going to run with. Um, I'm not really sure what height you need to get over the walls, but we're going to, we're going to be four. For, uh, we're going to do four. Excuse me. I can't talk. Four for safety. Rock 75, pretty standard for an Aerial Assault deck. You want to have this card maxed out just so you take uh, a lot less damage for three seconds. It's really good, really good. When you have three dashes too that you can cycle off, you pretty much always have that DR up. Dampener, uh, pretty standard card. Every Ruckus usually runs HP. It's really good with proximity since you know you do get more effective health with that damage reduction. Uh, Refraction and Crystal Faster are pretty st standard cards. Crystal Faster, not so much because uh, we are running Aerial Assault. We're not going to get an insane value out of it. But I still want to run it um, since we are lacking damage. Our left click really doesn't do that much damage without our missiles. But having uh, just 1.4 seconds off, it's helpful. And this, uh, this is a build we're going to go with. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Alright, Bizarre. Ideally, it's not, you know, the best map for Ruckus, but we are going to be trying something with Aerial Assault here. Um, normally, you would go Rocket Barrage on this map, and it's it's pretty hard to get good flanks off, just because, you know, there's really four own openings to the mid cap, uh, being the two sides here, top left, top and bottom under it. That bottom is usually the area you want to be at is Ruckus, just because you can kind of sneak through, you can wait on mount, try and get behind, uh, get under, uh, get under, go under, get behind them. Hopefully that, that'll be like a decent enough flank for them. We are going aerial assault, so we're going to have to play this a little different. We have a lot less burst, uh, more mobility, more potential. What did this guy say? Texture res over here. Oh, I don't have time to get over there. And I believe you could do something funky with the, the railings up top. Um, on on cap here, like this area right here, these little bars, you can do something weird with them. I'm not really sure, I haven't figured it out too much. I'm gonna stop this uh, mid flank, don't wanna like, let her just do whatever she wants for free. I have the ability to chase her too. She's going behind the. Nice, that's a flank down. We did lose a decent amount of our team. I'm just gonna poke. Get some good damage off. Greg needs to try and live though. I'm gonna passive heal. Once I get my passive heal up, I can maybe look for a dive on the Genos. I'm gonna have to try and retreat here. I think our team's uh, falling apart. Don't really know where our healer went. I need a passive heal though to get my HP back. Uh, let's see, we can maybe get a dive onto this? Zen is no billow, I'm pretty sure. Nice, we got a kill on him. We got the bear, or the BK. I'm gonna have to disengage. Fortunately, we do not have any heals. I don't think I've gotten a single heal this game. Just need a regroup team, we can win. Maybe I got a peel from my teammates more, I'm not really sure. I'm out. I didn't want to go up. I don't know why it sent me flying. I can hide and get my passive heal off. Alright, so we're deep. We're deep in enemy territories. You have to realize that the Mavia is spawning, so she's the one person that can kill me. Go ahead and push up now. I want to kill him. Oh, <laughs> unlucky. We tried our best there. Rip. Okay, our team is falling apart. Guys, we gotta pick it up. Our Talos needs to buy items. I need to stop feeding. Um, gotta, gotta be able to pick it up, guys. Gonna go and get on their Mave. Oh, that's, that's very hard. That's not hard. Ink. 
got a decent amount of missiles off. I'm gonna try and maybe go with the flank here. Get something going for us. I've got a pick, I can get on their healer now. He is one. I'm not gonna be able to get out, I think. Unless I gotta heal. Nope. It's fine, we should have a cleanup here. Not a bad fight for us. We got another healer, we killed them. Made a decent amount of space, got the BK low. So not a bad fight. Uh, aerial assault doesn't kind of shine on defense, just because we can already get through these gates, so like, ideally rocket barrage would be nice here, but... We could keep trying this. I think their team's pretty far back. Don't want to engage too hard. I got one there. I still kite because I have a lot of dashes. That's kind of the strength of it. We probably wouldn't, wouldn't have had that extra dash there to get out. It's nice to have. You know I'm kind of lurking here, so I'm gonna have to play, play safe. I'm just gonna play around cap. You're gonna have to touch with, I think, their tank. And maybe look to burn. The shield CD. Cyrus needs to be in a safer spot. I'm gonna have to flank now. Start looking for it. Okay. I'm stuck. Team. I need your heals. One. And now we should start cleaning up this fight. Not bad, not bad. Good defense by us. We're starting to get some items. We need blast shields, which is good against Fern, EK, and the Yomi hit of Zin. If you didn't know, Yomi is a blast damage since it goes through people, so that 850 damage is going to get affected by blast shields, but not as two slashes before that. Haven's, I think, weaker than Blast Shields. Resilience is good as well. Rejuve is good. I think I'm gonna go for. I think the Resilience buy. It's good against uh, good against the Mayvolt as well. You get Resilience too. Mayvolt will only last for two seconds, which is really good. Being blind for that long, longer than two seconds, is is really scary, especially considering every single one of your teammates is also blind. It's a really good engage tool, so. We can stop that from uh, affecting us too much. We'll have a better time being with their team. I think their flanks are going right. She got out of it. Gonna chase in. Come here, boy. Oh, someone should be able to follow up on that. That sucks. Gonna try and peel for our back. Huge ult, huge ult. Zen is no pillow, we can kill him. Yeah, he does have pillow. This might be an overcommitment by me. Got uncotted, he has no pillow. Now he has no pillow. <laughs> ah, I couldn't get my shield off. It's fine, looks like we're winning the fight. We're gonna go ahead and get master riding, we do want to get back faster. Good kill by Arceris. Only 20% on cap, so we do have another fight. We need to try and get back as soon as we can. Our team should look, be looking to zone and dismount them. Don't know if that's going to happen. Let's see if we can help our Talos here. Kill there. Oh, they're diving our healer. They're not a healer, our dredge. Got the healer. Kill for our healer. See, we need to get on Zin. Just went completely around me. Unfortunate, we can go BK though. Alright, mobility's nuts! Stash there, make sure we keep our DR up, that's really important in this build. BK could die here. Nice, Talus. It's gonna ult, get it off early on to the fight. Force the Nando ult out as well. Looking at the Nando now. We need to get record for him. I don't think anyone on our team does. Has it. Oh, she's one, so close. Nice, good ult by Talos. He's really. He's popping off, dude. 
All right, here's here's the strength of it. Do stuff like that. Although this is not really good for us. I'm one. You want more heal from us here, so we could try try that again. Okay. Just completely ignored me. Get behind. Don't know if this is a good play anymore. Our team is dead, unfortunately, so we have to get out. I think their team's here. Yeah, both damage is here. Three damage is here, so I gotta play this slow. Aw, uh, those raptors just blocked my, my missiles. My DR up every three seconds. Little does he know I could chase him. Uh, I think I might be dead here. Most certainly am. Oh, if you had dome for me, that would have been nuts. Makes one behind, guys. 15 seconds remaining. Ten, nine, eight. Come in. If we stall just a little longer and I can get there, I think we can, we can push it in. Our Cirrus needs to stay alive. He's no poppy, we should be able to kill him. Ah, rip. We have no healer, so not that big of a deal. We just need to build time for us to build our ults up. It's perfectly fine there. I think our, our bear got 34% back, I got 28% back, so not bad. I don't think I needed to ult there either. I thought I thought we would have pushed in a little harder and would have been decent, but we were pretty far behind in that fight, so it just wasn't that great of an ult. Should have held it. Should have just finished him off with left clicks and tried to get out. I was I was pretty deep there. Like once I once I dashed over and then dashed again, I was pretty much committing to that fight. I didn't I wouldn't I didn't have another dash up to get back. It doesn't seem bad. If you're allowed to flank like that, and you you coordinate it with your team, you could you definitely make something, make a big play off of it. My bear could have pushed in from main. I could have gone behind. We could have set up like a dome ruck assault. That would have been pretty nuts. Five, four, three, two, uh, I'm gonna go right side. One. Just gonna switch things up. Been going left a lot. I think we want to peel the flanks as much as we can. If we keep our healer up, we just out sustain them on point. Yep, heal for the Saris. Some damage on a BK. Stand a ulti. I'm just gonna commit to killing him. Got the BK a little bit, pop my emitter, make sure I don't take too much damage from that. Alright, it's 27%, we can look for a zone now. This is right here, trying to force out any of the CDs. Got counter. It's a lot of damage. I'm gonna rotate to the other side now, just switch it up. It's one. Looks like they get on their Janus now. I miss those missiles. That sucks. Run this in. You do it, team. Maybe next, if we can. Nice. Our Drudge is still alive. We can maybe help with Nando. I don't have too much damage. I can get touch for our team. Nice. He's in next. I'm gonna try and hide if I can. If I get another heal, that'd be great. Nice, huge, huge heal by our It's one, nice. We get another heal off. Should be good to go. Oh, that was a, that was a very close fight. 
Let's see if we can help our Telus. Ruin's kind of in a forward position here, so I'm gonna try and zone for it. You get out of position, I can collapse. Break shield, that's all we have to really do right now. I think Zen's flanking, but he's dead, nice. We can chase here. Not too far though. Alright, let's go let's go ahead and try this flanking out again. I just want to keep forcing it, because like th this is the main reason why I'm kind of playing Aerial Assault on this map. I want to just keep trying this flank and see how good it is. Alright, well, we're behind their team. We have house control, which is not bad. Oh no, this is tragic. I got baited by that door, dude! Alright, so we have to wait a little longer to do that, I think. I think it's a little, it's a little risky of a play, just because they could just commit to me instead of my team. So no worries, we just completely forgot about buying resilience and we just went mash riding, because why not? Let's get to the fight faster. Hopefully we don't get BK stunned and that bites us in the ass. It's one! We got two down, heal for the stairs. Oh no, we lost our healer. Try and get that offing on him. Don't know if this is a good fight, actually. Oh, we can. We can we can win this. Ah, we need to try and just stall. Stall as much as we can until our healer gets back. Get my DR going. Oh, I'm running out of mouse space. No, I'm stuck! Okay, not bad. I think uh, since we have no one really flanking that way, it's a, it's a little harder to pull off. So I might, I might just be throwing by doing that. I, th I think it's probably just better to play around my team. Make a touch. I'm gonna kill this guy for emoting in slow-mo though. Maybe. Oh. I don't have enough damage. If I was Rocket Barrage, that guy dies there. Okay, let's see. We almost have our tank ults up. We have Talisol. No Dredge ult, but that's that's kind of fine. Dredge ult doesn't really do anything. A lot of nimble on their Mave. I think we just keep doing what we're doing. Uh, we, we can't be too aggressive on their damages. No one else is diving. Just want to play really passive, peel for our stairs, make sure she stays alive. This barrack is definitely going to outcap uh, the Nando. Nando only is uh, general sustain. It's not going to last that long. It's not going to be able to last that long. Excuse me. Going to head back left side. Going under again. Under just gives us more more vision. See where everyone else is going. Like maybe spot him right. We just chase her. Got her down. Not if I miss my missiles like that. Still got her, nice. That's a nano shield out. Gonna have to kind of wait around that. Zin's one. You can maybe catch him here. Oh, I messed up that dash. Whoops. Good shield by him. I know it's a shield, we should be able to push him. Uh, can I actually make this? Oh, I can't. I'll just use another dash. Alright, we're gonna zone, zone right side here. Make sure they can't get through this gate. We can push up right here, we can see the entire map basically. They have to push through here or here. But we are gonna take a lot of poke if we do that, so I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna give some space. I don't see their Nando. Nando's the their tank. Yeah, he's touching. I'm just gonna go ahead and burn him with my ult. Cancel it, I wanna get away from that BK. It's just sticking me. One. She has a slither of HP. He's in next. He's one. I have to reload. And then it's coming back. Nice. 
All right, well, that, was, that wasn't bad. I kind of missed the burst that I had with Rocket Barrage, but Aerial Assault's definitely not bad on that map. If you can coordinate it in, in like competitive play where someone's like pushing in with you on that right side flank, it could be really strong, but since I kind of kept doing it on my own, I was just kind of throwing my life away, especially if I didn't get anything done. I had to go for like a sick flank with my ult or somehow coordinate a push with the rest of my teammates, but GG's, fun game. Uh, mid camp, I actually really enjoyed playing Ruckus there with, with the dashes, felt pretty good. Uh, we we lack damage, but you know, being able to rotate around and and chase that Mave around, it it was really nice having that third dash. Um, we only ran fuel reserves, fuel reserves four, not bad. It's good to know that um, we might be might be able to get over the walls with fuel reserves three. I think you wall jump and then dash over it, and it's bad. It's pretty good, but didn't mind the build there. We had two points of crystal faster, just give us some extra missile CD, extra makeup damage. I don't really if I know if I really noticed it, but fun game. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. It really, uh, I'll really appreciate. I really appreciate it. I can't talk today, geez. Um, but hopefully you guys enjoy the content. I keep uh, pumping out stuff for you guys. See you guys next time.